Welcome to another Discover Estevan 1v1. Uh, Nolan Cole joined by Addison Shields, and Addison is a member of the Estevan Viragos girls football team. They just finished up their season uh, actually this past weekend. So, uh, Addison, thanks for doing this. Uh, I guess just to start, uh, just just give me a, a summary of, of the past season for, for you and, and your team. Um, it's been a really good season, I think, from our first game to our last. We've improved so much, and we've had so many new girls this season, which is so great. So I just think it, it was a good season all, all over everywhere. So tell me how... how you got involved. Uh, I mean, were you a multi-sport athlete or why football for you, Addison? Well, um, I played a lot of basketball for school teams, um, the Lex team, elementary school. And my friend Haley Tanyard, um, she was on the team for a season uh, when it first started. And they needed more players and uh, tribs like Mark Tribs. He was like, get more people out here. So uh, one of the practices, my friend Haley, she made me go. And then just to try out, you know, see how it felt. And I fell in love with it from that practice on. Right on. Uh, sorry. And did you play other sports growing up as well? Yeah, I played basketball. I have been playing basketball for, I think, four, maybe a little bit longer than four years. Um, and then like volleyball, I've played like in elementary and all that, but I don't really play that anymore. So you said you, you liked it from the start. Um, did you choose running back or did your, did, did your coach want you to try running back? How did that play out? Um, well, my first year, uh, I was on defense and I was an inner and outer linebacker and then they switched me to corner and first game in Regina, you know, I've never watched football in my life. So it was so scary for me, but I got a couple interceptions that game. So they were really happy with me. And then, um, yeah, I played defense all that first year. And then my second year, which was spring, um, they put me as a backup wide receiver for one of the games. And then they saw my speed apparently or something like that. And then one of the practices trips was just like, yeah, you're the running back now. Awesome. Um, now, I mean, you said you hadn't seen watched football before playing. So I was going to ask you if you were a big football fan, but I, I guess not that, right? <laughs> yeah, no. Only like my parents, they watch it. And I was like, oh, football, no. But yeah, no, I love football. So now you love it. So, I mean, and, and you said you were hooked from the start, right? So I guess, uh, and you were, you said you were scared too. So I guess, you know, you're obviously trying to recruit more and more players um, to, to build the program up. Um, what would you say to girls who are maybe on the fence about trying it out? Do it. <laughs> I mean, it is scary, but all the players on there is such a good environment to be on. There's so much support through anything. Like it, it helps a lot with a lot of problems for me. So I just think any girls that are scared and that need to take out some aggression, have some problems going on, do it because it helps so much and the people around you make it 10 times better. How, uh, how I mean, you're only 14, so you've got, and you play on an 18U Estevan Viragos, right? So you've got a few years left. How excited are you for next season and trying to maybe take that next step for you and your team? I am so excited. Hopefully a lot of our... Um, fall girls from last season come because we've had a lot of new ones um and I'm just so excited because our last game we were looking so good and especially with all the newbies I just think we're gonna do really good in this fall you know you mentioned your last game against Moosom in this past Sunday right how, how did that go overall um I think it was pretty good we got some nice tackles and we almost got a touchdown so close but I think we're getting closer and closer to feeling what it's like to be in the, like close enough to be in the end zone and like doing all that and how like thrilling it is and how much pressure. Hey, last question for you, Addison, uh, I, I guess just about the sport itself. Uh, how, are you excited for, for the growth of girls football? Because I know it's becoming more professionalized in the, in the United States. And there's some talk about maybe sending an all-star team down there from Saskatchewan. Um, how excited are you to see that, uh, the growth of the sport and maybe trying to grow it here in Saskatchewan and Canada too? Oh, I'm so excited. I know a couple of my friends that are actually on the SAS team and they're just doing so well. And I'm so happy that it's starting to be more of a big thing and to see that, especially for women. And I'm just so happy.
Would you like to compete in the in the U.S. one day? Maybe one day. Good stuff. Great. Well, uh, Addison, thanks so much for joining me, and and best of luck with the team next season, and best of luck with uh, with your own career as well. Thank you very much.